What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Texas Chainsaw Massacre the game video. Today we have two very exciting announcements. First, crossplay is confirmed and will be in the game at launch and we officially now have pre-orders available with a price of $39.99. I think it's the perfect price and you can officially go and pre-order now on the platform you're choosing and if you do get a physical copy you will also will be able to get the exclusive poster that will be inside of the case it is a gorgeous poster i definitely recommend getting it of course in the case it will be folded up so if you want the poster itself to frame in pristine condition you can actually just go purchase it from gun's website i recommend doing so i'll have a link in the description if you're interested in that very exciting. We're getting that much closer. Pre-orders available. No word at this time on bigger limited edition sets, but since they didn't get announced right away, I'm starting to doubt that they're going to happen at all, which is a bummer, but it's not the end of the world. At least we're getting a physical edition in general because there was a chance this was going to be digital only. So pros and cons. Now let's talk about crossplay. We were pretty confident it was going to be in the game at launch, especially because during the technical test, there was an option to turn it on and off. But now we have confirmation it's going to be there at launch, but there's a little bit of a catch for those of you that are playing on previous gen consoles. So based on this chart here, you can see that Steam, Windows, Xbox Series X and S and PlayStation 5 next gen consoles will be able to play together on crossplay. However, if you're on Xbox One or PS4, you'll only be able to play with those who are playing on the same console as you. In other words, Xbox One players will be playing with Xbox One players, and PlayStation 4 players will only be able to play with PlayStation 4 players. Like I said, this is a bit of a bummer if you're still sitting on previous gen, but hopefully there are enough players that this won't be an issue, that you can keep finding games regardless of not actually playing on crossplay. And for those of us on next gen consoles who don't like playing against PC players, no offense PC players, I hear you, but that can be really annoying because cheaters are definitely a lot more frequent over there, that you can go ahead and turn off crossplay if you want to, but by default, crossplay will be toggled on. So, something to keep in mind when you first launch the game come August 18th. Now, aside from that, crossplay works in your typical fashion, like any other game that has crossplay in it, you know, inviting people within the game itself and not using your console friends list, icons to display what console you're on, etc. The big other question was whether or not there will be cross progression. So in other words, if you were to level up your character on Xbox, that progression would be saved and still apply if you were to play on PlayStation at a later date. However, they did confirm that cross progression will not be available. It'll be tied to the individual platform you are playing on. Uh, that's not the end of the world. I mean, just stick to the platform you're playing on. And uh, if anything, it gives you more things to grind. Let's say you max everybody out on one platform, jump over the next and start over. Now, aside from all this news, we do know that the pre-release party is this weekend in Austin, Texas, which will be available for some press and content creators. We actually are going to be there. We are going to film everything we possibly can. And I'm hoping to get a video out on this Sunday, June 18th. So if you want to see that, and you're not already subscribed, please do so. Turn notifications on so you don't miss any updates like this in the future. And if you enjoyed this video as well, drop a like and let me know if you got the game pre-ordered in the comments below. And of course, as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.